gems, how are you doing? How's your day been? I had a couple of people join me in my live this morning. Um, kind of, I set it up and then I got a message from Cindy B saying, I'll try to get up in time and I'm thinking, hang on. I did it for morning here so it was night time in the US and I've looked at the time and then gone, oopsie. I incorrectly scheduled it. Um, yeah. So I had to go in and change the schedule and which then meant that not many people would have got notification. But for those of you that did do it, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, it was uh, quite an interesting process. Hang on, let's grab it. Oops, there goes my head. For those that didn't join and want to know what we're talking about, I did a live resin pour of this potions bottle. Okay. How cool did she come up? So if you want to see that get done, um, yeah, go check out the live. I was actually happy with it. Um, for those that joined me in the live, I haven't filled it yet. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll get to that one. Did do something else, didn't I? I did the brooch, but you guys saw the brooch. And I don't know where I put the brooch down. Hang on, brooch. And this was just a simple brooch. She came up pretty. You get in the kit that I got, where you actually get the brooch findings for it. So, yeah. So that was that was this morning. Oh, that seems like so long ago now. That was that was big. That was big. Um, yes, it was only an hour, but it was still big because. After that live, I then had to clean the mess up because resin makes a mess. Um, and then what did I do? I was trying to edit a video. Um, oh, and I recorded another video. So I've record, been recording some videos uh, and editing and storing them up. So some will get released. Well, the videos that I'm doing at the moment are going to be released round about when I am away because I won't be able to do much in the way of recordings um, there will be no editing of anything so if I do a recording it will be with my phone <laughs> highly likely um, yeah because I don't think I'll find a peaceful location in Esperance well there is peaceful location but not where I can do those recordings um, so yeah how is your day going? Mine has been full on because I am now overly excited and as much as, well, this is the first, no it's not, no I did start painting this morning. Um, I, all I want to do with this, this piece that I'm working on now, yes, you see I'm so close to being done. I just want to put it aside now because I now know who the artist is for Diamond Shop. My package arrived today and I unboxed it today and oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That's all I can say. I am buzzing from what, what, what I got. So um, stay tuned, 5th of June, videos will be released by all of the Dim all the um, Diamond Ambassadors at the same time. But for me, the waiting is over. Except the only thing about the waiting being over is that I now want to kit it up and I want to work on it and I just want to put everything I'm doing all to the side and just work on that one because oh love it love it love it love it love it the artist is um, I can't give any details about the artist but I've gone in and had a look at his website and here we go you know I'm excited because I'm talking with one I'm just diamond painting and talking with one of my hands um, I've gone in and had a look at his website and oh, there we go. So the artist is a male. There's a little slip. 
Um, and, oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> there's some stuff on his website that it's like that would be a good diamond painting that would be awesome so um guess who's going to be contacting them and go yeah any chance of this one being in the collection because <laughs> that's what happened last time um with when we had kathy delance say and you can tell her, I'm really excited about it. When we had Cathy Delance launch, um, I had a look at her stuff because her her stuff was on. <sighs> Why has it gone from my head? It's a website I look at for pictures and to compare stuff. Deviant art. There we go. Straight off the bat, finally remembered. Um, so with Cathy Delance, I went and looked, um, discovered she actually did have stuff on, on DeviantArt and I found one, I found something on her website and I asked Rowana and Reggie if that was going to be part of the collection. Actually, no, I'd seen what the collection was and I'd actually asked for that additional one. I'd asked for that one to be done as a custom and see if I could get, get it. Um, that was La Fee's. So that was the... Um, well, I might put the picture. Um, Lafay's was. Hang on. Where was Lafay's? I will show you. The Lafay's was. So that was the one that I added from Cathay de Lancet that I had them add for us. So that was that was absolutely beautiful. That diamond painting. So hopefully with this new artist, I'll be able to find out what's on his. On, on what he's going to be what's going to be available for him because there's some there that I've just gone yes <laughs> um, so yeah now as you see I am so excited to actually get to and do it um, and hanging for it I was going to be trying out some working with some polymer clay but um, well I had actually I was working trying trying polymer clay for the first time this afternoon uh, my doorbell rang it was mr fedex so i fedexed everything over to the side and took started unboxing this package from diamond shop so um yep 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 so excited anyway that's my excitement that's what's coming for you guys for a bit of excitement um there is a competition in relation to this, so um, yeah, stay tuned, 5th of June. What I am going to do now though is, because I haven't been around for a couple of days, I'm going to go through the comments that I haven't spoken to. What's happened to my screen? For, oh, there's four days. Whoops. Four days, four days. So if we go back to comments on the short weapon chat, let's have a look. Um, hang on, guys. This might serves me right for doing trying to do something quickly. Okay. So, my comments that I've got, let's go walking through. So some of these are quite old. No. Where are they? Sorry guys, I'm trying to go back. I know there's four days, four days it's been since I answered any comments. And that's why, because that filter's not there. Oh, my computer is playing silly buggers. Okay. I'll just wait for my computer to catch up with all the comments. Um, <laughs> yeah, the um, Sophie and Toffee Disney box, the villain's box. That's, that's a really cool box. That was a funny box because I was on night shift 
And like I work two separate areas and one is really quiet and one is not quiet at all. But one gets so deadly quiet that uh, there's not you, you know, there's not that much to do. Everything happens at once and then you're quiet for at least an hour. And so I was on YouTube looking at things and I saw the um, Disney box. I saw somebody working on it and went, oh, that looks like fun. I've got to give that a go. <laughs> so hence, I ended up <laughs> ordering that. So online shopping, it was just before midnight on the, where is it? Just before midnight on the 29th. So there was only two days left of being able to purchase this kit. So I, I purchased it. And lo and behold, it arrived on Monday, which was it Monday? No. Arrived something. No, it was, yeah, yeah, it arrived Monday. Oh, I'm losing this track of time. So it arrived yesterday and I unboxed it and I put a notification up on Facebook and there's people that actually were part of the subscription and theirs had been shipped months ago. Um, but because of the way things were, you know, their stuff has been shipped and it's all caught up. Whereas mine got shipped and since a lot of the restrictions have been lifted, mine was shipped and it came through so quick, so quick. But that's DHL. Okay, so where are we at? Hang on. There we go. So, oh, talking about nails, that short weapon chapter talking about nails. And Mindy's saying hers would be just black with dirt because it's planting season. Oh, so spring, yeah, that's right, it's spring there. We've just hit winter. Can't remember the last time I had dirt under my nails. I have gloves, my fingernails go through the gloves though. And Cindy B is uh, kind of envious of my nails. Cindy, I've read other comments there. Um, I'll talk about those in a minute when I get there. Um, yeah, a mani petty right now in this environment would be really good, but uh, yeah, yeah, just for what's going on in the US, you guys have just got everything happening at once, for it seems to me. Um, yeah, scary times. I went into a, a world where of night shift. Well, when I go on shift, I end up in a bubble where I don't see the news, I don't see anything. But what I do see is very limited. Um, and so, yeah, I've just seen a heap of stuff that's going on. And I've got a congratulations from Marilyn and Anna. So this is the one that, she, that she's saying, the walking area is very pretty, but wouldn't be walking there in the dark. For, uh, I will say, Anna, for this, for, for where we are, it's not necessarily dark. Well, it is dark, but it's not. Um, there is so many security cameras around where we are. And um, that walkway is actually behind massive fence. And yeah, it's, it's a safe spot safe spot to walk so um, if anything did happen I think within 15 seconds there would be somebody out there work out there sorting it out um, we are in Australia we're pretty lucky in in Western Australia and in Perth we are really lucky because um, you do get your criminal aspects but there's some parts of Perth where uh, it doesn't happen that much. It's a rare occurrence. Um, so, yeah. Um, okay, so the congratulations is yes, 1,000 gems. Woohoo! Oh, um, I'm still trying to work out how to do what to do. Well, how to do this, the giveaway. Um, 
I'm not quite sure how to do it. And I want to do it, I want to do it soon, uh, but I will put in the but. Um, with the fact that I've got the diamond competition going and that I am disappearing for a week, a week and a half while I go down and visit my grandbaby. Yes, no more congratulations on that one. Um, on my grandson. I really seem strange to say that. Um, I will do it when I come back from, uh, from that. I just need to disappear and go and do the family thing. Um, if it was up to me, I'd be I'd already be down in Esperance, but because I haven't, my hooping cough hasn't kicked in yet. We can't go down there, and then we've got to, Nathan's going to take time off as well. Uh, so yeah, okay. Um, Kathy thinks this is pretty pretty walkway with the benches, landscaping architecture. Yeah, it is very pretty there. Um, thanks Gail who just made my life this morning <laughs> to you <laughs> thank you um, Sue um, heart goes out to you Sue um, watch you watch what you can when you can um, yeah my heart goes to you it's hard times at the moment and thank you Rivka Have, congrats on the thousand Happy for me. Glass are turning up. Beautiful. Yes, the glass are slowly getting there. Um, work for work ways. There's something in there. Hang on. My, I keep going back to this one spot, I think. Must be a bad drill. No, it's gone now. Um, they are turning out beautiful. The, the walkway, it... It's not that dark around there, but yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Rivka. Gail. <laughs> Gail's actually looking at the one where Bo's sitting out the window and, and looking and reminds her of he, her kids when they were young. I wish I could go out and play. Yeah. Snack size paintings. Yes, they are good. Um, feeling accomplishment in a short amount of time. Yeah, well, that one was done in what... I think it went out to 10 hours to get that little butterfly one done it's quite cool to do uh, so yeah and I got a blade loved it thank you blade I had um, okay then the vi villains box so the conversation on the villains box um, bottom right Hades somebody else Evil Queen, the bottom left is Ursula from the Little Mermaid. Little Mermaid, not sure about the right one. So it's Ursula and Queen of Hearts and the Beasles. Um, we'll get it established eventually. When I actually go and do it, I'll be able to tell you what it is. Okay, um, what else? So yeah, all these little comments from people, Cassie saying that things are box is Hades not quite sure cool Disney box um, Rivka because <laughs> Rivka gets the subscription box as well but she didn't want that one um, the I will say this much though there's something interesting next villa next Disney subscription box which is it's done once every quarter uh, the next subscription box is Cinderella themed so keep an eye out on that one, Rivka. You might want that one. Hutch and Hutch. Top right, Evil Queen from Saving Beauty. The bottom left, Ursula from the little... Yeah, not sure about the lower right one. We'll figure that out. I still haven't. The Beezles are covered. Yep. Um, Anna likes the kit. Crafting with Christy. Um, also likes that they are cool. On the box is Hades and Ursula. So there we go, Hades and Ursula. Um, so I've just got a comment on the the utter madness. Epic video and friends. Sure, we can be friends. 
and yeah, all the excitement. Did you like that little whip and chat that I was kidding up for and getting, well, getting the polymer clay sorted out? Did you like that style? Um, so instead of just sitting and diamond painting, I can be doing something, uh, which is, yeah, it's still work in progress, isn't it? But I just hadn't, I had so much I needed to get done that it was just like, I, I'd i gotten this out and I was working on it. It's like, oh, I'm going to do my daily chat, my, my short whip and chat. And it's like, oh, well, this way you can see what else I'm doing, what else I'm playing with that I'm not necessarily bringing into the channel, but I'm trying out. You know, if I if I like it, it well, I'll bring it to the channel if people are interested. Uh, if I can't if I can't get my head around it, it won't come to the channel. So yeah, um, Gail's congratulations. You love being a grandma. You call your maternal grandma Nana too. Okay, yeah, okay, cool. I'm a grandma to three, and they call me grandma or grandma Gail. Never worked with polymer clay. My, I may someday, but I'm worried I'm not creative enough. So with the mop, with the polymer clay in beetles, you don't have to be creative. Um, is what I'm discovering. So yeah, Brittany. Oh, I'm sorry, Brittany. I haven't worked any more on my cut blank custom. Um, I haven't worked any more on it. Uh, it's. I suppose one of it's one of those things where. I've got to be in the headspace for it, and once you do it, once you if you work on a blank, you'll actually understand uh, what I mean by that because it's a big, a big job. I mean, it, I will say, if I'd done a thirty by forty, it would have been done by now. Um, <laughs> but it's just, it just, it does. And you get there going, yeah, I've got to get this, and it's like, oh, I'm not the mood for that. <laughs> So sorry, Brittany. I will get there with it. And Gail's track record of it isn't hit, isn't there, isn't very good, but you made it this time. Thanks, Rivka. She hasn't worked with polymer yet. And Koala Craft. So this is the first time you've commented, so I'm going to have to go check you out. Um, so Koala Craft became a donor for the first time on May the 1st. And she makes pens and jewellery out of the clay. Mm, you're someone I'll come and uh, come and get some inspiration from. And Brittany's, I had a look at my butterfly tome lats. The question she's put there is an interesting one. Do you always outline first on your diamond painting? The answer to that one will be no. I just realised I didn't cross do that one properly. No, I do not usually do it. The reason why I did the outline or the edges of that diamond painting was because it was just going to be um, basically that was the only thing I was working on was just that one and I had all the colours out and the kit the drills weren't going away at all. I didn't kit that kit that up, I just set it up in the trays. Um, so it was just that was going to worked on until it was finished. Uh, which is why you got the time lapse because it was there and it never moved. But in that situation, I was able to work my way around it and get the edges done. But I did in most cases with that one. Excuse me. In that one, I did um, do a lot of what do you call this? Not crisscrossing. Oh, okay. you can see how scatterbrained I am. Checkerboarding, there we go. Um, I, I love doing checkerboarding and you'll find that I don't do a lot of multi-placing, but I do love the checkerboards. I have multi-placed, but I don't like the results. For me, my res the results with the multi-placer are just not, not happy enough to deal with it. Um, but yeah, that was why, is because I was actually doing, it was just one job, I wasn't, finish I wasn't finishing up with it. Um, so yeah, sorry, unfortunately you missed the live. Hope to catch the next one you do, love your video. Uh, also a question if I'd sell those cover minders. I was looking at selling cover minders, um, but I can tell you at the moment with the way postage is and all the delays everywhere, it's not something I'm keen to do. 
Um, I was keen on it, but not with the way things are at the moment. There's not a chance, not a chance of even just sending one as a gift, um, trying to send something at the moment. I, I've got some stuff I want to send out, but to send it at this stage, it, it, you don't know whether it's going to get lost or where it's going to go. And Rachel Ray, lower right is Hades from Hercules. So we've got two people who've gone, yep, Hades. Where's the box? Hang on. Oops, oops, oops. So we know, ouch, 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 here we go. So we know Melissa from, Snow Queen, Ursula, so that's from The Little Mermaid, and Hades from Hercules. So now we know who the villains are. How cool. Because I couldn't even, didn't even know where these were from, but she's from The Little Mermaid, so not being sexist, I had boys. They didn't get into The Little Mermaid, and I think they were old, too old for that. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Well, oh, geez, look at this. I've rabbited it on. I've chatted and chatted and chatted. This is nearly half an hour. Um, and all I want to do is go kit up a diamond painting. <laughs> uh, oh, that's tomorrow's job now. Tomorrow's job. So I will leave it there, guys. I will say thank you for joining me again. For those that made it to my life, thank you. Um, lives are hit and miss and i will say t today's life was quite interesting because there was a lot of silence <laughs> between everybody else was i'd say was doing stuff and just looking up and watching because i with what i was doing it was a case of i'd look up and i, I couldn't comment at some stage i couldn't comment because i was concentrating so hard um yeah but that turned out pretty wicked. That turned out pretty wicked. I like her. And it is so light. Potions bottle. Okay, so guys, I will leave it there. Rabbit it on for way too long. Um, I will chat to you later. Have a good night. If you have, give me a thumbs up, thumbs down. Leave me comments. As you see, I do respond to your comments verbally. Um, I give you a heart when I'm actually talking so you know when I'm actually recording a video and I'm talking about it is be it's because I put a heart on it. Um, so that's that's where I go through and I put a heart on the, on the comment while I'm working my way through talking about them. Um, but yeah, I will say I will talk to you, you gems later and um, bye for now.